My name is Hiroki, Hiroki Oda. I'm working for Sony Computer Entertainment Japan Asia. Today, I'm very happy to be here to officially announce presentation for launch to the Malaysia market. My name is Haba, in charge of, now uh, I'm from Sony Computer Entertainment Singapore, in charge of this uh, Southeast Asia. So, thank you very much. Um, so, what do you expect from the PlayStation 4 launch in Malaysia? Yes. And uh, finally, finally, today officially announced PlayStation 4 launch to the Malaysia market. We are going to launch PlayStation 4 just from December 20th year by Sony's 3D price uh, $1,799. Actually, we after we officially announced the uh, PS4 launch within this year, we are getting very positive feedback around the South Asia. So we are pretty, pretty confident to succeed phase four here in Malaysia too. Yeah, yeah, same as on the side. <laughs> <laughs> this part is okay. <laughs> um, okay. So, you know, PlayStation has a lot of online support, right? Yeah. Uh, so what kind of online support can Malaysians expect? So online support, of course, we are, we are doing the PlayStation Network, so customers can enjoy the download content through the PlayStation Network. Now also, uh, we are providing so-called uh, plus membership. So this is a sort of the uh, subscription service of PlayStation content. So people can the easily the, uh, enjoy the uh, PlayStation uh, game experience through the subscription service for PlayStation uh, Plus. So will all the games be available for online download, or are there some unavailable? Uh, no, we are preparing. We are preparing. So as, much as, as much as as much as possible, we would like to provide to the customers. Okay. Which games should people buy for PlayStation 4 to fully experience it? Actually, this time we will run 23 titles together with PS4 hardware console launch. But uh, especially the uh, Kill Zone and Knack, especially designed for PS4. So uh, please uh, enjoy here yeah, this uh, exclusive title for PS4, which is Knack and Kill Zone. Kill yeah. And they're showing up Marvel's, like Lego Marvel superheroes in there. Right? Yes, it's a yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Yes. One of them. Have you played it? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Still no time. <laughs> we'll try, we'll try later. Okay. Yeah, I'll try there. Uh, there are a lot of uh, independent studios opening yeah, up. Yeah. So what is PlayStation doing to help those independent studios outside the Western markets? Like, say, people from Malaysia, they want to get a game on PlayStation. Yes, actually here yeah, we are supporting, here yeah, we are communicating with the uh, indie, so called indies and uh, developers. So, not happened yet in Malaysia, but uh, all, we all already have some collaboration in, so, so, for example, Singapore developers. With, uh, which is, uh, uh, then we have the, uh, some development support from Tokyo side. We ask them to easily develop the PlayStation title and we help them to publish the titles all over the world. Actually, the feedback from uh, it's very good. So we are continuously making effort to support local developers uh, to develop and uh, ask us to publish these good titles all over the world. So if say, <laughs> it's quite loud there. So if say, a um, Malaysian developer wanted to get a game on PlayStation. Could you just call uh, yes. Abasan? Yes. Yeah, yeah, please. Yeah, yeah, please give us your Always. contact, and then <laughs> we also we want to do some support to uh, make some good goal to yes. publish a yeah. good game. You might be hearing a lot of calls. Today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay, okay, yeah. yeah. Uh, Vita TV. Yes. It's very small. I yeah, the smallest, smallest yeah, console. Do you expect to sell a lot in uh, this region? Yes, yes. Of course. Of course. Of course. <laughs> what kind of buyers do you think will buy it? Yeah. Most of them will have a PS4 at home. Yeah. So why do they need a PS4? Yes. So one, um, let's say, the uh, proposal recommendation from our side, PS4 has a remote play function, which means when customer connects PS4 together with PS Vita or PS Vita TV, these customer can enjoy PS4 game titles on PS Vita screen or the PS Vita TV through the big TV screen. Uh, Let's say you don't need my two PS4 
only one PS4 you can enjoy through the PS4 uh, PS Vita, uh, PS Vita, PS Vita TV. It's good, uh, good and bad, but this is we can provide better service to and better experience to the customers. Will you create a bundle to sell all three devices together? Yeah, yeah, we try to make some bundle promotion. Well, of course, basically, we, we offer to this region. Then, uh, especially in this Malaysia, of course, try to make some collaboration with Sony to show the, uh, to provide more better service uh, to appear our PlayStation business also. Just one last thing. Do you have any messages for local fans? Local fans. Local fan. Anyway, this time uh, we could organize that kind of event in Kuala Lumpur. So we want to get more interest in our business, our products. And of course, we will try to uh, reply to those kind of interest to our, our PlayStation. So anyway, uh, our game shop and then our Sony store, we will uh, make a display. So please come to our shops to touch our products and then please uh, feel and experience our PlayStation 4 and the Press Vita TV or Vita. Oh, thank you always the uh, PlayStation fan in here in Malaysia. Today I'm very, very happy to officially announce PlayStation 4 will be launched on December 20th in Malaysia. So I'm expecting you rush to buy PS4 and enjoy the latest game with PS4. Thank you very much.